guys, welcome back to No Catchy Name. It's me, Ella. Today I have some happy mail that I thought I would share with you guys. And there's also a truck outside, so if you hear that, that's a truck. <laughs> but I got some of this happy mail last week and I got one today. This is a bladed uh, Christmas card. Well, you know, she sent it in time. It just took a while to get here. From Tina in California. I already opened it. <laughs> this is so cute. This says, Have a Goat Christmas. It's going to go. <laughs> Wearing a hat. That is so cute. Company is this by Haynes Besco. That is so cute. So thank you, Tina. And then I also got I got this in the mail from a book um, company, but it didn't say who sent it. So I have no idea who sent this because I know I didn't order it. <laughs> but it's a crochet kit. You can see me <laughs> right there. But it's called Super Cute Crochet: Ten Super Cute Projects for Animal Lovers. I already opened it. I haven't um, started using it yet though, but I did open it. So it comes with a little crochet book. Got a little bunch of little animal patterns. <laughs> and it comes with the yarn. It says to make two, but it didn't say which two. I'm assuming the pink one is one of them. Because it's gray and black. So maybe two pink ones. Because there's no brown. And then also behind the box, there's some stuff in that is... Um, vacuum sealed there's safety eyes in there and there's a crochet hook and a crochet needle so um that's cool i appreciate it whoever sent it to me but uh it didn't say who it was from so maybe they wanted it to be anonymous or uh i don't know <laughs> but uh i do appreciate it and i will definitely use it the next thing is a package i did a swap with Haley for christmas um i sent her package and she sent me a package hers is a little delayed because <laughs> um mailing incident but of course, I already opened it. So I went, but it's been sitting in the box because I've been waiting to share it with you guys. I got this uh, last week sometime. So here it is. It's a bunch of goodies. Okay, one is this really cute Notions pouch. Really cute. It's made out of like a, like a canvasy type material. And it's rainbow, which I love. And then there's a cute uh, hand towel, dish towel, with a snowman on it. I'm gonna save the yarn for last. And in that notions, there's some of the wrapping paper. <laughs> in that notions pouch was this bag of teas, and there's also some true lemon uh, lemonade and raspberry lemonade. So that'll be fun to rip into now. I've been trying to keep it all together so that I can um, share it with you guys first. And there was two of these. These are those cake saver things. They're like they're made out of jersey material and you slide them over a yarn cake and as you use the yarn cake it like compresses it so that the cake doesn't get all floppy i have another one of these that was gifted to me it's got cherry blossoms on it and so i have two this one's got little scotty dogs and this one's got sloths which makes me think of jill <laughs> from fiber floozy uh there was sugar cookie hand sanitizer which is cute and then there's a sugar cookie bath freezer Cute, but that smells good. And then there was a puzzle. I'm gonna do this. I think I might do this today. It's got buttons on it. It's so cute. And then there was this little fiber up my nose. Um, organza bag with little Christmas light stitch markers. And then there's this little um baggie with these are like paper clips but there's like there's like little bones and like swirly things it looks like there's a coffee cup one like a travel mug in their little decorative paper clips and then there's a yarn hashtag yarn life tin and inside of it is a little tiny pair of snips some um those plastic stitch markers and weaving in needles and Thimbles, I guess. <laughs> That's what those are. Silicone thimbles. Uh, and there was some paper goodies. Okay. This is a really cute um, stationery. You open it up and it's got envelopes and little note cards. So some of y'all might be getting some of these <laughs> in the mail eventually. Really pretty floral print. And there's this cute little uh, notebook. It says, follow your dreams. It's just a regular notebook. And then there's some, right, this is a notebook too. And there's this cute little notebook too. <laughs> and 
and then stickers. So there's this big book of stickers. And it's got a bunch of cute stickers in it. And some postcards. And then there's this little book of stickers. Planner, like planner stickers. And then she sent me a few um, little sheets. This is a little one of those magnets. And it says, be joyful always. And it's a cross. But she sent these little, um, these few pages of stickers. And this one. <laughs> really cute. Alright. Oh, and a little tiny notepad. <laughs> I'm trying to show everything but the yarn first. This little um, notepad with unicorn on it. And then she knitted, and she says she knits these a lot for gifts. She like works on them all year to gift people. Me a set of dishcloths. I'm going to use these for dishcloth because it's what we love. And these are my absolute favorite cloths to use. These knitted ones. So she, I'll show you the variegated one first. Because the other ones are colors from the variegated one. These are my absolute favorite ones. I love these better than crochet ones. I don't know, they just, they work better in my opinion. And then she, a purple one. A light purple one. A teal color one. And like a mint color one. And they all match this one. So that's awesome. Now I can use them. <laughs> but yeah, this is my favorite dishcloth pattern. And I had some gifted to me a few years ago. And I've been using them, but they're starting to fall apart now. So, um. I'm glad I got some more to restock with. Alright, and now yarn. She sent me some yarn goodies. Okay, she sent me two balls of Red Heart Buttercup. It is a number five bulky. And there are 64 yards in each ball. So she sent two of them. And uh, that's what it looks like. It's kind of like pipsqueak almost. A little bit thinner looking. She sent me a ball of I Love This Yarn print. I feel like I have had some of this. Or maybe I bought some for someone. And it is a 252 yards. It's number four. And the color is called Blossomopolis. <laughs> Super pretty. I love that. And then she sent me a Ferris wheel, which I've never used a Ferris wheel. I've looked at them before, but I never actually bought one. So it's a line brand Ferris wheel. It's 270 yards, size four. It says one ball can make a scarf. It's 100% acrylic. The color is summer day. That is so pretty. There's the fair as well. <laughs> really pretty color. And these are two um, Premier Sweet Rolls. This one doesn't have a band on it, so I don't know what the color is. But they are 245 yards each. They're number four acrylic. What? And the one that has a band is called Jelly Pop. Really pretty. <laughs> and the other one is purpley purpley and pinky those are really cute that's all my goodies i got from the swap with Haley. uh i didn't used to do a lot of swaps but lately i've done a couple i think this is my third one and it's a lot of fun it's a lot of fun to just get you know yarns that i normally don't buy myself that someone might just send me <laughs> it's like I've, I've looked at these and looked at these and i never bought one but now i have one so i can play with it and see if i like it <laughs> but uh, i'm excited about the puzzle i'm gonna go do that i'm gonna get my puzzle rollout thingy I'm excited about all of it and the teas. There's a bunch of teas in here. Open it. So here, there's this blackberry apple cider. Um, this is a night, nighty night one. Two of them. I like the nighttime ones. They they help me like relax. I guess that's the point. <laughs> uh, this is that R word one. I never can say. Root room. I need to look it up. English breakfast tea. Blueberry Slim Life Green Tea. Throat Coat. I've been wanting to try this. I saw that Hannah from the, 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 what's her channel about? Cozy Cottage Crochet? Um, she drinks this a lot. And I was wondering if it's any good. Like if it actually works. Um, Peach Passion. And then there's, uh, Lemon Zinger, which I like Lemon Zinger tea. And then there's these little, uh, True lemons, which people, I've noticed, you know, a lot of people put them in their tea to add, like, a flavor and lemoniness. <laughs> Seta does it. And this is, but these are, like, the water pack ones. I don't know if you can use that. But these are just the regular lemonade ones. And there's two raspberry lemonade ones. So, I'm looking forward to that. <laughs> I got a lot of tea gifts to me, and I'm slowly trying them. I don't drink them often. 
but I'm trying to get like one every few days because I want to actually like taste it and have like an honest opinion of it. <laughs> I don't want to just like chug them and, and not actually taste them. Yeah, so I'm gonna put that in my little box. I got a box of tea in there. People always gifted me and I'll just grab one out. I keep them kind of separated, the caffeine free ones from the ones with caffeine in it. So like if I want one at night, I can get the caffeine free one and get her going. I do use some liquid stevia in some of my teas because some of them need a little bit of sweetness in them. But uh, I do want to try putting the true lemon in there because I think that might sweeten it a little bit. And uh, I don't know, we'll try that. But thank you so much, Haley and mystery person <laughs> and Tina for the card. Uh, I appreciate getting anything from you guys and it's never expected or anything. And it's just a lot of fun to, um, I love doing these swaps though. I'm gonna have to do some more swaps with people because it's a lot of fun. I love getting new yarns. And as you can tell, most of my yarns are like solids because I make a lot of amigurumis. I've been kind of branching out. This was gifted to me. I bought these bulky ones. These are Dollar Tree yarns. This was gifted to me and I rolled it up and I still haven't used it because it's fingering weight. <laughs> and I got some weird yarns over there. I bought all those happies. Oh, right there. There's six of them. And some random ombres and another hank yarn up there. And I just like getting, um, you know, I don't like buying yarn because a lot of times I look at it and it's pretty, but I can't think of what I want to make with it. So I don't want to buy it just to have it sitting around. Haha. <laughs> Which is ironic because I have a lot of yarn just sitting around. But I like it when I get gifted because then I don't have to have that guilt of buying it. Because <laughs> now I can just look at it and try to figure out what I want to make with it. But yeah, I'm going to have to start doing more swaps with people because it's a lot of fun. And it's a lot of fun to come up with uh, gift ideas for people. But yeah, I'm going to go ahead and hop off here. And I'll see you guys in the next video. <laughs> Bye guys.